Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingphase.com. Your boy's back and I done did it again. Hashtag coding phase, hashtag the coding way. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you like this video. Okay, so another person got hired. Okay, another person came to the website, got what he needed, and he's already hired. All right. Within a month, the guy, he's ready to go. He got the projects that he needed. He got the portfolio that he needed. He got the skills that he needed. So he just sent me an email and I'm going to read it out for you guys. So this is going to be a new segment for this YouTube channel just to share the success stories. Okay. And I'm going to try to get people here to come in and, and maybe do a Google Hangout with me and, you know, share the stories and see how much they learned or see what they actually benefited from, you know, being members of codingphase.com and I'm going to try to do this at least once a week. All right. Sometimes some people might want to come in on Google Hangout, but sometimes some people don't want to show their faces. Sometimes people just want to come in and send an email. So I'm just going to read it out for you guys. All right. So I'll see you guys in a second. All right, guys. So this is the email that I received from Louis Kafka. Okay. So he says, hello, sir. My name is Louis Kafka. I have a degree in computer engineering, which I did not like. So I've been studying web development for the nine months. Okay. For, I guess for the last nine months. So he says during that period, I began to doubt my skills and what I learned from Udemy and free code camp courses. I've been a subscriber since last month to your courses. And I just want to say, thank you. You provided me with the necessary skills and project at a professional level. Surprisingly, two weeks ago, I applied for a front end developer position. I had two interviews on the phone one with a recruiter and one with a team lead. Okay. During the technical interview, the interview was mostly based on how I will rate myself to certain skills and no coding test was provided. I was given an on-site interview with the company's web team. The interview went well as they were interested that I had a portfolio site launched with GitHub pages, projects, and an e-commerce WordPress website and the passion to continue learning from resources like YouTube. I also mentioned your name to the team. Hey, smiley faces. Okay. The day after they called one of my references, who was my friend and basically that I made an e-commerce website for today, I received a call for verbal agreement to a front end web developer position. I just wanted to say thank you for what you do. And as always, I learned something new from you and Please tell my fellow beginners that having a portfolio, being able to use a CMS and having knowledge of HTML emails, forgot to mention they do this too. And also the information from the company website, such as looking at the brand standards, such as colors and fun styles they use, help me land this job. Thank you again. I'm so happy to start this new job in three weeks and also it's a nine to 80 job every other day so every other friday off okay uh thanks to coding face all right so pretty much as you guys can see this is another success story okay uh one thing that you will see is like hey he already had a computer engineering uh degree and that goes to show you that even though you might have a degree you still could benefit from codingface.com because the fact that we have real projects uh, real things that you are going to be doing at the job, you know, things like HTML emails. I focus a lot on the front end as far as making sure everything looks exactly as the design. I teach you guys all the different little CSS tricks to make sure you are able to convert any type of uh, design into HTML CSS. You know, I also go into JavaScript, teach you about the um, back end, teach you about WordPress, teach you all of the things that you're going to bump into on your first job. All right. So even for guys with degrees and guys who have been coming from Udemy and free code camp, right? Like you might be stuck in that world of, you know, tutorial heaven and learning programming languages and learning framework. But if you don't have the right projects in your portfolio and you don't have a solid portfolio that makes you stand out, then it's going to be harder for you to get a job. 
you gotta always remember this the same way how you want this job there's probably another 50 developers in your area that want that same job so for you to get a second call or a second interview or even the third interview you have to have the right projects that's gonna make you completely stand out and say you know what this guy is a professional okay so I just wanted to point that out because I know somebody in the comments is gonna be like oh but he had a computer engineering degree guys that's all theory you know what I mean that's all theory that's all you know dealing with algorithms and you know just like the the basics of computer science right like that's all theory you know databases and things like that but when it comes to web development almost all of those things go out the window what really stands out is your projects the type of websites that you have built and if you have the skills to hit the ground running like when somebody hires you at a company they want you to hit the ground running they don't expect you to go in there and be like oh you know uh, in my school we focus on C sharp or C plus plus and Java and it's like I don't know PHP and I don't know JavaScript but you know if you give me two to three weeks I'll you know I'll learn it like they don't have time for that they don't have time for you to go in there and be like oh we'll train you on the job like nobody has time for that guys like if you're getting hired because they need you at that moment not to say hey we're gonna need this guy a month or two months from now once he really learns web development you get what I'm saying so even guys with degrees are coming in to codingface.com and and getting what they need okay so I'm going to try to continue doing this more often and yeah man i hope you guys enjoy this type of videos where we share what's happening with the community we share how people are getting jobs we share everybody's story i'm gonna try to do google hangouts but like i said there's some people that they just don't like to be on camera they don't feel comfortable you know they're scared and that's fine all right so don't worry about it if you are a developer if you're somebody who have been coming to codingface.com you got your job you got your first gig you got your first uh, freelance gig online like let me know send it to me I'll read it out loud for you guys you know it really helps out the community because it just helps people to stay motivated and see what's out there you know if we don't have people sharing their stories then it's like nobody knows who actually is getting jobs. It's, it's good for people to know who's getting jobs out here. Okay, guys? So definitely send me out your, your story. Send me your, your information. And it, it's just going to help people out, right? Okay, so guys, if you are looking to learn how to code, go check out my website, codingphase.com. You know, I teach you everything from the syntax to the basics, but what I focus the most on is really the projects and making sure that you have a solid portfolio so it gets you ready to become a developer and get you ready to get hired, right? Like, even if you've been learning how to code for the past few months, you're still going to get a lot out of codingphase.com. You're going to be able to have a solid portfolio and solid projects that's going to push you forward. You know, if you come here and you go through my description, there's a 50% off and you get all of my courses completely for a single price, right? And you get 50% off automatically. So this becomes 10, this becomes 100, this becomes 300. So literally go ahead and go to the website, click on the description below if you really want to get the, the, <laughs> the coupon, right? But definitely check out the website, codingface.com. And if you guys got any questions or anything that you guys want to ask me before you even sign up to the website or you want, I don't know, you want to see the type of projects that we're building, send me an email, codingface at gmail.com. And yeah, I'll show you everything that we're working on. All right, I'll see you guys later. It's your boy Joe back at it again, codingface.com.